Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting bring to episode two of Demon Slayer Entertainment Districts. So let's go ahead and get started in three, two, one, go. So basically strippers, sex. <laughs> oh my god. It's intentional. I'm surrounded by idiots! <laughs> I mean, you, you, like, damn, we can't do a head start to- Jesus Christ! Poor babies. <laughs> see so are we meeting the wives today because I, I know i know a lot of like everybody is freaking out about the fucking wives and hopefully that we get to meet them today i mean because there is one that i'm actually really excited to meet because her saying is like ah! <laughs> i just don't know what she went which one she wears Hopefully, I know when I hear her talk. and damn, I ran all through the fucking day just to catch up with him. <laughs> and you can finally get there at night. Huh. 
I know. I mean, like, yeah, it's your first time in a big place, but come on. Oh, Okay, because I was about to say, like, can they get the fuck out of prostitution? This is just pimps and hoes. Let me not. like five minutes. <sighs> I mean, well, look at him, though. Yeah, I'm about to be like Cloud from, you know, Final Fantasy VII. <laughs> Well, damn!
Of course. Okay, why the fuck would you stick your tongue out? Oh my god. I know this he's fat! Oh. Right? <laughs> oh shit. All right, just one left. It's got to be alive.
Poor baby. <laughs> Not pretty. Just curious. That should be. Hmm? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but if you do that, people will know you're a boy. You don't need to, like, fuck up the mission.
Charlie voice like he did his kitty toe? <laughs> Poor baby. She pretty though. Yeah, I just got to see the other two to see how they look. Cause I mean, you know, showing just a little bit of them in the opening, I just I need personality now with them essentially. So I'm guessing we're gonna get that in the next few episodes. But yeah, see, give me fucking dresses, girls. It's so cute. Yes, all the Final Fantasy Seven moments. Like, oh, I just feel like this season is just going to be like a thousand times better than season one, even though it's only eleven episodes. I do kind of unfortunately dislike that because I felt I was thinking I was like yeah it's gonna be like twenty four episodes right and this ain't gonna end until like spring no but I mean I'm excited this is gonna be so good for them oh my god <laughs> I was really expecting. We were gonna use our girly voice, Kinito. <laughs> I mean, yes, it's, it's right. You do have a husky voice. I mean, it's a very nice voice, but at the same time, it's like, hmm, we gotta be that type of person. <laughs> Oh, poor baby. <laughs> it's like when most of us girls, when we first get into makeup, and then we think we <laughs> we're trying to either learn like um, wing eyeliner or. <laughs> done and we think we look pretty and then we look in the mirror and we're like oh shit like damn we just fucked up our face like yes our face is a canvas and everything but like oh <laughs> and I, I, I don't think they started to do make up themselves but <laughs> I mean they looked pretty I, I, <laughs> I can't <laughs> they look pretty that is all I will say that's all. I mean, you know, with um, with Inosuke, because of the fact is like he has both masculine and feminine features, especially with his face. Um, he he's like out of the three, he is the one who doesn't really necessarily need makeup. The other two, yes, like straight up. I I you know I was expecting like a little bit of lipstick, maybe just some eyeliner, um, mascara for their eyes to like you know wing up their eyes and everything, and some eyeliner. And this is that and third, <laughs> the cheeks. <laughs> the cheeks. I love it. I love it because it's going into very like traditional makeup. You know, in, in the modern. I mean, not well, not in the modern era, in the traditional era and everything. And but still, they look good. Really, I, I'm, we're gonna have a fun time with this. <laughs> I think probably every single week I will be either laughing at them and anything that they're wearing. But they they look good. <laughs> it's gonna be something. But like, hopefully. Yeah. <laughs> 
Hopefully. <laughs> Eno's gay is able to get wife one out. Because honestly, I'm really excited to see how her voice sounds. Especially because, like I said, I know one say you who I like a lot just as much as my favorite is in this show. And so now this is their second. Oh, well, no. This would be like their... How many shows have those two worked on together? Probably like a lot. Um, but I don't think they're going to interact because of the fact just like they doing their own things. I don't know. Maybe we'll see. But, uh, you know, probably when we hear her voice, that's probably when I know, oh, yes, that's her say, you know, that's her. Or I'll probably cheat and just look. But yeah, I really enjoyed this second episode a lot. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode two of Demon Slayer Entertainment District Arc. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And of course, I will see you guys hopefully next Sunday, even though I will probably be working on Sunday. If I don't get the video out on Sunday, despite whatever time I do come home from work, I will have it come out Monday morning instead. But until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye!